Howdy folks, this is Checkers back again with another episode of our Nuka World Vacation spin-off of our Fallout 4 Let's Play. And we are here at Fizz Top Mountain. We have just met Nisha of the Disciples, and the Disciples are all around us here. They seem to be, I don't know, maybe the most traditional raiders. I could be wrong, I haven't met the pack yet. The operators seem a bit more, hmm... A bit more civilized, but we'll see. We have someone over here to meet, it looks like. Damn Nuka Cola song stuck in my head again. I have a solution. Anyway. Um and we're trying to, of course, suppress my homicidal impulses when dealing with raiders in general. The parlor. Who have we got here? You're gonna head on in, over boss. Oh, well, I guess we're meeting the operators. Well, let's go give that a whirl. So far as they've got that pit boy on his arm. So, our new is a vault dweller. Or ice the vault dweller. Hmm. You can go. So, we've taken a dinner theater and turned it into our base of operations, have we? Look, a target. Hi! You must be Mags Black. It says so in green text. Hey there. Well, I suppose we all owe you for putting down Coulter. Man was an idiot. Made us all look bad. <laughs> A clown stuck in his own little car. I guess we can take some solace in the fact that someone finally gave him what he deserved. I want to know, what did you feel as you did it? when you brought that walking pile of human garbage to his knees. Hmm. What were you talking about when I walked in? <laughs> what were you discussing when I walked in? Well, you, Overboss. You're an unknown quantity, and we're interested in knowing who we're dealing with. So we'd like if you answered the question. Yes. What went through you as you crushed the life out of that oath? Mm, I would say a thrill. Taking down an opponent like that? It's thrilling. Sure looked it. Hmm. Perhaps you're better suited to this than I expected. Regardless, Gage's decree means that you're the new overboss. I suppose we can only hope you work out better than the last one. I'm Mags. This is my brother, William. Pleasure. Along with our co-conspirator, Lizzie, we run this crew. Call ourselves the Operators. You'll come to understand soon enough that we are the only gang you should be backing around here. Because we're the only ones who see this place for what it is. A temple. A testament to the only thing that matters in this world. And what's that? And what's that? Cat. This place was built for the sole purpose of taking caps out of the pockets of fools. We only joined Gage and Coulter's little menagerie in order to restore it to that goal. Though by somewhat more cutthroat methods than I expect its founders intended. Instead, Coulter had us sitting on our asses for the better part of a year while he lived large in his damn mountain top. And that means, if you're going to be in charge around here, We'd like some assurances that you intend to bring this place back to its true purpose. And that we're going to get back to robbing folks of their fucking money. Why should I support you? And you want to explain to me why exactly I should be backing the operators? Because we dispense with the bullshit. My people aren't commanded by lunatic bloodlust or animal instincts. We are the only rational players around here, and would make valuable allies, so long as we know you intend to get this place back to bringing in caps. So we want to know what your plan is. Well, money's my goal. My goal is to use this place to make all the money I can. Well, it's about damn time. Hmm. I look forward to seeing your claims put into action. So, you're welcome in the parlor whenever you like. Make yourself at home. 
And if you think you might be interested in running some jobs for us, you just come speak to me. And we'll all be anxiously awaiting getting this place back to doing what it does best. Operator's got no tolerance for dead weight. Those who can't cut it, they're gone. Although, I don't know if you guys are really as cutthroat as Nuka-Cola, I have to say. Not supposed to hurt the other gangs. No rule against tricking them into hurting each other, though. Interesting. If Lizzie asks you to volunteer for one of the tests... No, 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 no. You do it like this. See? There you go, kid. All right. Now... Thanks, William and Lizzie. All you have to do is hear them speak to know they weren't born into this life. But they sure as hell were born for it. Hmm. Huh. Interesting. They kind of remind me of... Oh, who are those guys in New Vegas that ran the strip? But you get special treatment. Yeah, frisking me would not end well for you. Um, let's see. Now, somewhere over there, 63 distance units, Remember, we have some... you won't see hidden cappy codes without the glasses. Make sure you're wearing them while you search. Um... Okay. Brad Burton's office requires key. This is the back... Oh, yeah, this is where we... When we first came out of the cola cars. All right, all right, all right. Let's see. Now we are heading... To our next group, probably the pack. And the stars out. The traders stealing food. You a oh. sheep or a outside wolf? Outside the gate. Because the pack only runs yeah. with wolves. Yeah. Then I got in a little extra target practice. Oh, you guys are really the special. The pack lets it all hang out. Apparently so. And you guys found where the clowns kept their makeup. Welcome to the nest, boss. We was wondering when you'd make it down here. Ah, uh, as soon as I found enough bird feed for you all. And I love your teddy bear armor. Brad Burton Amphitheater. Open. And here folks thought robo-brains were strange with their exposed brains. Alrighty. Okay, so somewhere between the Disciples and the pack, we've got your standard raiders with their pet mole rats. Ain't no one sad about Coulter. Just don't screw this up. And something that sort of looks like a dog. If you can take something, it's yours. Detonation collars. Is that an actual dude standing up there? No, just a mannequin. I expect the Joker to come out somewhere. Okay. Can you talk to Mags or something? You said we ain't allowed to kill any of them, so tell me. Did you have to wait in a long line this season? No. I walked right up here. Exactly. Most can handle their own shit without bothering you about it. Do you need help finding your place here? No. No. I can handle it. There's plenty of collars in the kennels if you can't. Got a chase if you want to catch. Okay. Why don't you go catch and chase and there's a, a doggy who wants to go with you. Now that I get a closer look at you, not sure I'm buying this new overboss thing. You gonna be a problem I need to solve? Slow down there, boss man. We're just getting to know each other. Name's Mason, the Pax Alpha. This here's our side of town. You might be over, boss, for now. But I'm the boss of the pack, and it's gonna stay that way. Long as you don't go forgetting that, we're gonna be fine. Your people aren't gonna cause me any problems, are they? The pack does what I tell them. You don't get in my way, they won't get in yours. Hmm. 
I'm going to try the sarcastic response. The pack? Oh, fitting. You smell like animals. Ah, never heard that one before. Look, it ain't like anyone's broke up about Coulter. Just figured on his replacement being, well, different. But Gage says you're the boss now, so you're the boss. You don't want to lead? You don't want to be over, boss? If I thought the other gangs would go along, yeah. I'd run this place in a heartbeat. Might have to, if you turn out to be a turd. At least it ain't Mags Black, that freak Nisha. Besides, you can't possibly be worse than Coulter. Well, it depends on worse. I have plans. I have big plans for this place. You'll see. Maybe you're the real deal. Well, we thought Coulter was the real deal, too. He's laying in a pool of his own blood. Don't get oh, you've heard wrong. about my plans. Coulter was definitely overboss. Not a man to mess with. And things were good in the beginning. Real good. But that was a year ago. Then Coulter went soft. Wanted to take stock in what we achieved. What do you want? So what is it you want? Caps, action, something. Anything that's more than the sitting around we've been doing for the last year. I'm listening. I'm listening. Sure, this place beats living in the shitholes we had out there. But it ain't the palace of Caps we signed up for. Ain't none of us happy. Not even the disciples. And they're normally a chipper bunch so long as they're drenched in blood. <laughs> Things were going to hell fast. But Gage put the brakes on that. Got us together and promised he'd find someone to deal with Coulter. The truth about Gage and Coulter? So what's the real story behind Gage and Coulter? Hey, I only know what I've heard. Story is that Gage talked Coulter into becoming overboss. And he got you in here, didn't he? Maybe he likes people owing him. Maybe it lets him get things done without getting dirt on his hands. After Coulter went soft, Gage got us behind closed doors and promised he'd get someone to off Coulter. And you did just that. Might have been the whole point of the gauntlet all along. Interesting. Oh. Uh, I guess I'll just say I'll be a good leader. You can trust me. I'll be a good leader. No offense, but you just got here. We'll see what you can do. Look, let's cut to the chase. You're gonna do right by the pack. I hear you've been talking to the other gangs. Be a good dog and do what you're told. Or you'll be put down. Oh there, boss. Not in front of my guys, all right? You got enough to worry about without a dominant struggle inside the pack to deal with. One last thing before I let you go. There's always work to do around here, keeping the zoo in order. If you're ever able to lend a hand, drop by. Loyalty's a two-way street. Okay, well, now we've met the major players. It ain't easy keeping the zoo. And the, one thing that I think, since I don't really know anything about the rest of the park, is that... It sounds like we have to take it back by force. And it seems to me that the pack here, with their penchant for excitement and action, would be good shock troops. The people to send in first to deal with whatever dying needs to be done. Then to send in probably the disciples Mason's to mop up. For you. And then let the operators clean up what's left. But... I'm still thinking, if you wanted to make all the caps in the Commonwealth and nearby, you would really want to turn this place back into what it was. Maybe that's just me. Somebody else with a detonation collar on them. Got four good hours of sleep last Nope. Night. Just wondered if that was one of the things we could steal. Although, we don't really have our pickpocketing cranked up quite that far. Now, where are we going now? Back to Fiztop, or do we have something else? That last one died too fast. I'm losing my tongue. Looks like Fiztop. 
Sure, we carry guns, but knives are where it's at. Oh, it's not fun unless you're up close and personal. Nisha really only has one rule around here. Don't get information. Oh. What on earth did I get stuck on? Anyway, moving right along to the ice cream wagon with a Nuka Cola Quantum sitting in the window. Oh, and some Mr. Handy Fuel, an aluminum can. Let's get that light on. Sorry, guys. Stim pack, Nuka Cola, sardine cans, 16 shotgun shells. Always welcome. Dirty water. We could open a branch office here. That with a dirty to pool. Ah, made us team up. Too many voices Hang all at once. Nice with others. Run away over boss. Run away. Okay. Now it actually wants me to go in here? As opposed to it down there. Alright. Well, let's give it a whirl. No, it just wanted me to go up. That's okay. We've been through here already. Alright. Ooh, look at that. Are they restocking these? Or did I just miss those? Up we go. Okay, got our little elevator, elevator dance in, and 17 bottle caps. Gonna leave those still. Um, out to the patio. Mm-hmm, back to Gage. The overboss returns. Well, you're back in one piece. That's a good sign. Everything all peachy with our friendly neighborhood psychopaths? Sure hope you didn't promise them too much. I mean, going a little over the top is part of the game, but you don't want them holding it against you if you can't deliver. I told them that you were going to do a topless dance. With fans and balloons and a flamingo. But other than that, they're on board. All the gangs are on board. I knew you had it in you. Time to roll up your sleeves, boss. There's work to be done. This place is huge. Divided up into sections. Parks, whatever the hell they called them back in the day. We need to take them all back. One at a time. Every section we secure gives us a little more breathing room and more resources. You stake a claim. Plant a little flag for one of the gangs, and that settles it. It's theirs for good. Who gets what, that'll be your call. Whoever you hand it off to will appreciate it, but the others might get a little jealous. You know how it goes. Plant a flag? Plant a flag? Are you serious? Dead serious. Look, you leave it up to anyone else, the gangs will all just fight over who deserves the space. A lot of these idiots can't read. So it needs to be as plain as day for them to get on board. They know what to watch for. So that's it. Nice and simple, right? Take a minute. Settle in if you want. And then let's get to it. And hey, we're in this together. So I might as well go all in. You want me watching your back? You just say the word. Um, what's in it for you? <laughs> Why? What's in it for you? For the love of... Ain't you been listening? I'm the one that sold this whole idea to the gangs. Shit goes south. It ain't just your head they're gonna want on a stick. I like my head where it is. So if I can do anything to help keep it there, I'm gonna. So, what's it gonna be? We doing this together or not? Um, hmm. Sure, why not? Great idea. That sounds like a great idea, Gage. You've got a deal. You're the overboss. Okay, well, we're back to having a companion, which means that I've just lost a whack load of carry weight. But maybe we don't have to run back to talk to him every five minutes. We can talk to him on the road. For now, I think we are close enough to time that I will... Oh, look at all we that. Secure... Get moving soon? Or maybe we'll just shoot Gage in the mouth and leave him here. Anyway... 
I think uh, we will bring this episode to a close now. And we will, of course, be back in episode 9, I believe. I would like to thank you for joining me and all of your kind words and support, as always. I would like to remind you that I have a Twitter link in the description of the video and on my channel main page. If you're on mobile, it'll be on my channel about page. Also, if you look in the upper right hand corner, you will see a small letter I with a white circle around it. These are cards and links to other videos that I've made. I would like to thank you for watching. I hope you found the video entertaining and maybe just a little informative. I would like to invite you to subscribe and ask you to please take care.